How's it going guys? Today I'll be doing a Green Arrow Year One review by Andy written by Andy Diggle and art's done by Jock. It's a six issue mini series made by DC Comics. And I'll tell you the su summary about it. Oliver Queen is a playboy and a thrill seeker at after yet another drunken party. He decides to embark on a sea voyage only to be betrayed by his only friend and trusted bodyguard Hackett. He then finds himself marooned on a desert jungle island. Oliver survived his new unforgiving environment with nothing more than a makeshift bow and arrow. Gradually realizing that he's a natural born bowman, being stranded on the island for months taught him to treasure the simple things he had squandered. And the first time in life, he was happy. Things took a turn for the worse when he learned the island was not as deserted as he thought. A woman, whom he called China White, had enslaved the island's inhabitants and forced them to grow opium and manufacture heroin. After a tussle with Hackett, who turned out to be her business associate, Oliver was seriously wounded. Tayina, one of the native it is on the island saved him from certain death. It, her selfless act of kindness opened Oliver's eyes to the guilt he's been carrying his entire life. The guilt of stepping over the unprivileged on his way to the top. To repay the debt he owed Tiana, he made it his life's calling to fight for the right of the downtrodden. He then Freed the slaves by taking down China White's organization armed with armed with a bow and a dozen of arrows. When the authority arrived, Oliver downplayed the whole scenario. He sacrificed the credit of busting a drug ring in order to protect the lives of Tiana's people. Believing that it's not his style to bask in the limelight anymore, he chose to live a double life in a brash social light. By day and night, something, someone he never dreamed he would be, a hero. Upon, re upon his return, return to Star City, he crafted a costume and took the name Tiana gave him, the Green Arrow. If you've ever seen the TV show, some of the ideas, theme, concept has been originated from here to there. Out of... This is one of my favorite books. It's kind of what started me to reading uh, Green Arrow. And I'll show you some of the art. Looks awesome. The art's phenomenal. The writing's phenomenal. And there's not a whole lot extras. Just the covers. Give me a sec. There we go. And yeah, tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. Thanks, bye.